How many times have you been heading out the door only to notice that your phone battery is kaput? You're gonna blow your top, aren't you? Then you make your mad dash to find your charger, and your phone is literally dying. But what if you don't have the time to wait for it to charge all the way? Here are 12 mistakes that may prevent you from doing this as fast as possible. Now, remember to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell to join us right here on the Bright Side of Life. Now, counting down from mistake number 12. Not charging your smartphone from a wall socket. Charging a smartphone from a laptop by using USB is undoubtedly super convenient. After all, you can keep surfing the internet while simultaneously feeding your phone's battery. But that's a wrong thing to do if you need to charge your cell phone fast. It will take as much as one hour longer than when you use a wall socket. One more advantage of charging your phone from a wall socket is that you can opt for a portable USB battery backup that has a built-in wall charger. The great advantage of this device is that it charges your phone first and only after that juices up the portable battery. Cool, huh? Number 11. Not charging your portable charger If you don't have a portable power bank, consider buying one, since that's a great investment. This device will be extremely helpful if you need to leave home in a hurry but suddenly discover that your cell phone's battery is critically low. Not to mention, these things charge a whole lot faster than smartphones do. Charge your portable power bank for 10 to 15 minutes before you have to run off. Throw it in your bag and connect your smartphone to it for a quick battery boost. Number 10. Using an improper USB adapter. You need to get an adapter that puts out exactly as much power as your phone can deal with. Some smartphones have their own wall adapters, but you can also use other models that have similar features. On the other hand, if you have chosen a wrong adapter and it's too low power, your smartphone may refuse to charge or will do this extremely slowly. Besides, if your phone has an option of quick charging, you should check if the adapter you're using supports this function. If you figure out that your adapter is unsuitable, find the necessary one. You'll spend some money, but this will save you a lot of time. Mistake number 9. Constantly checking your battery charge level. Lighting up your smartphone screen is a sure way to kill its battery nearly as fast as by using the internet. As you may have already guessed, this is also the wrong thing to do when your phone is charging. By nervously checking your battery charge level, you don't make this process faster. But if you really need to be in the picture, turn down the brightness of the screen to a bare minimum. Number 8. Not switching off features you don't need at the moment. Now, if you're in a hurry, it may slip your mind to check if you have some unnecessary applications open and running on your smartphone. Wi-Fi, GPS, Bluetooth just uses your phone's battery power and slows down the charging process. That's why you should turn off all features you don't need at the moment and make sure your smartphone isn't updating apps or doing backups. Number 7. Not turning on airplane mode When your smartphone is switched on, it needs a lot of energy to function. Even though you might think that when you turn the display off, your cell phone doesn't expend energy anymore, mm, that's not true. Your gadget is constantly trying to perform different tasks, from searching for the nearest Wi-Fi signal to running updates and getting chat messages. And the more your smartphone is doing at the moment, the more slowly it's charging. If you know that you won't be getting urgent calls for some more time, turn on airplane mode on your phone. As a result, it won't waste battery and will get fully charged pretty fast. Number 6. Not using battery saving mode 
This mode comes in handy when you need to make your phone last for as long as possible. But few people know that switching this mode on can also make the process of charging their gadgets much faster. To turn on this mode, open Settings, Battery, and then Battery Saver on Androids or Low Power Mode on iOS. Number 5. Not removing the case Removing the cover from your smartphone before you plug it into charge. Surprisingly, many phones start to charge faster and more effectively if you take off the case. When you keep certain types of cases on when you charge your phone, this may lead to excess heating of your device. That's why if you feel that your smartphone is getting too hot when you're charging it, try removing its case. Number 4. Letting your phone get hot. Uh-oh! The previous point is closely connected with this one. You shouldn't let your device become too hot when you're charging it. Try to charge it in a cool place. Don't leave your phone charging in a hot car or in direct sunlight. When you use a portable power bank, avoid charging your smartphone in your pocket or bag. If you don't let the battery become too hot, the process will be faster. And remember that if you insist on charging your gadget when the environment is too hot, you can cause permanent damage to the battery. Mistake number 3. Using wireless charging Wireless charging is certainly very convenient. After all, you don't need to worry about all these cables. At the same time, wireless chargers still can't fill the battery of your phone as rapidly as conventional wired chargers. If you aren't pressed for time, you can appreciate all the advantages of wireless charging. But if you're in a hurry, the best thing you can do is use a good old wall charger. Number 2. Not maintaining your battery If you do proper battery maintenance regularly, you'll prolong the lifespan of your phone's battery. On top of that, you won't have any problems with the speed at which it charges. The main thing you should remember is to let your smartphone's battery die a minimum of once a month. The reason is the electrons of a lithium-based battery. These tiny guys need to get active from time to time. That's why you should charge the battery of your phone to 100% and then run it completely down every 30 days. And number 1. Believing popular hacks that promise to charge your phone in 10 seconds. Uh-huh. The internet is swarming with articles and videos that promote a method that can apparently help you to charge your phone from 2 to 100% in just 10 seconds. You're told that everything you need is your gadget, a wall charger, and a piece of aluminum foil. You're supposed to wrap your phone in the foil so that only the charging point is visible. After that, you simply connect your smartphone with the wall charger, plug it in, and count to 10. They say that your phone's battery will get full to the brim in this minuscule period of time. Unfortunately, technological development hasn't progressed so far yet. And this widely advertised method of charging your phone in 10 seconds is nothing but a myth. But probably you've tried it, and did it work? Eh, if so, write about your experience in the comments below. Now, do you know any other means to charge your smartphone fast and effectively? Don't hesitate to leave your recommendations in the comments. Hit the like button, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to this channel to join us on the Bright Side of Life.